Taylor Gray has climbed out of his truck. He is running away from us. Taylor, I'm going to walk with you here. What's going through your mind right now? That was the push away from the microphone. His team told him, calm down. We will get them next weekend when it'll hurt. Yeah, that, that's the thing you talk about him, Michael. You know, yeah, he d didn't want to lose this race. He had the best truck. He dominated the race. But again, these, these drivers have memories. And now I think he's probably got the 17 of Taylor Gray and maybe the 99 of Ben Rhodes. Both upset at him would, a little bit? Yeah, I would guess so. And Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. Yep. Well, NASCAR uh, security is to his left right there. He's got his team. He's got something to say about that finish. Taylor Gray on the outside. NASCAR 28 points behind. NASCAR security is walking with him, hoping he walks it off before they have to intervene. You hear him say, calm down. There's Bob Pachris. I don't think it's working. I don't think. He feels any differently now than he did when he got out of the truck. We knew emotions would run high tonight. So much your whole season's on the line. Well, and you got to think also. And the fans see it. They see it on the Jumbotron. As Phil said, as this march continues. As Phil said, a second place finish with Ek from Eckes would have got him to Phoenix to race for a championship and not made enemies. The team trying to protect their driver. We apologize for that language. That's NASCAR. It's all access. The microphones are on. The emotions are running high. He just lost a shot at running for a championship.